everyone welcome back to my channel thank you so much for joining me today in today's video i am going to be getting you guys to help me decide what to wear for new year's eve i have a couple of outfit options and i'm stumped i don't know what to wear so i'm going to show you all of my outfit ideas and then if you guys don't mind just commenting down below which one is your favorite so that i can wear it for new year's eve honestly the way things are going I might just wear this so that's why I wanted to start off with this outfit because I might just end up staying home I think this is pretty cute I got this at Aristia the other day I really love the color combination together this is one of my outfit options and if I'm having a very chill uh, night in then this is probably what I'm gonna be wearing but I wanted to show you guys anyway just because I think it's really cute um, just the color combination. Let me show you guys my first option that I have for New Year's Eve. Uh, so this is my first outfit option that I have. I wanted to start off with a bang. This is my mom's dress. It's just this like really beautiful sparkly dress, which I think is so, so cute. I think that the dress has a lot going on on its own. So I wanted to pair it with just a simple clutch. And then for shoes, Oh, I don't know if you can tell, but I'm just wearing some heels. So this is the first outfit option that I have. Okay, so this is my second outfit choice. I guess I should preface by saying I'm just spending New Year's Eve with some friends. Uh, it's really nothing crazy. Like I'm not really going all out, but I love dressing up for New Year's. So I don't mind dressing up and like going all crazy and going all out because I love New Year's so much. I just, I love dressing up for New Year's. So. This is my second option of an outfit. This one is definitely a lot more casual than the last one, but still super, super fun. I'm just wearing this really, really beautiful top that I got from Reformation. It's red and it has butterflies on it. I have my leather pants on and then, <laughs> and then the same shoes as my last outfit. And then just a shoulder bag too. I thought that it tied it all together. I put my, uh, my hair back so that the top can really shine and this is my second outfit idea for new year's eve so if you guys like this one the best let me know down below but stay tuned i have a couple more outfits still <laughs> so yeah this is the second outfit idea i have let me know what you guys think down below this is the next outfit that i wanted to share with you guys i just have this beautiful beautiful cowl neck dress on it's from urban outfitters i got it such a long time ago i've yet to wear it so i thought this could be a cute occasion to wear it. Um, so it's just this beautiful champagne color. So I thought, you know, champagne, champagne on New Year's Eve, it might go well. <laughs> um, I paired it, I paired it with just a clutch bag again, just cause I mean, I just thought that that would look cute. I just have these shoes on and they're just like a nude heel. Cause I thought that they would look cute with the nude dress. And then I just have a blazer over top. Um, realistically though, like if I was just hanging out at my friend's place, I would ditch the clutch. I would ditch this. Obviously wouldn't be wearing shoes inside the house, but this is probably what I would, what I would just be in for the actual, like, for the actual like New Year's Eve part, you know, but that is just what I would show up in just with the blazer over top, just cause it gets really cold where I am. This is the next outfit. So if you guys like this one the best, let me know down below um and then i have one more outfit to show you okay and then this is my last outfit idea for new year's eve um i just have these tights on with hearts that i think are so so fun i just think that they're so fun honestly <laughs> um i have this black satin mini skirt on and then i have this beautiful green top that is also like a satin material that i just thought paired so well with the tights and just a shoulder bag and then I just have some loafers on and then yeah this is my last outfit idea that I had this one's definitely a lot more casual than the first one or the last one that I had but I think it's really really fun with the tights I, I love the tight aspect of this outfit so if this outfit is your favorite let me know in the comments below and I also just wanted to share with you guys um what I would be wearing over top of all of these outfits for except for the very first one in sweatpants obviously <laughs> um but this is what i would be wearing over top of all of the outfits going out even on top of the blazer just this incredibly fun hat i love this hat so much this gives me like like 
really cool, fashionable, older lady um, from New York in the 90s vibes. That's the vibe that this hat gives me and I just, I'm so here for it. I love it so much. And then I would just put on just a black coat like this and whatever bag I had on as well, obviously. And yeah, this is the last outfit that I had for you guys. I really hope that you guys like this video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Leave me a comment down below. Don't forget to let me know which outfit was your favorite so that I can wear it on New Year's Eve because I don't know which outfit I want to wear. I'm like, do I want to go all out with the first dress because it's just so beautiful? Do I want to wear, sorry, it's kind of hot. Do I want to wear um, the red, uh, the red shirt. I haven't worn that one yet and I love it so much with the butterflies. The satin dress is also so cute and then these tights are just to freaking die for so I'm stumped so I really need your help. So please don't forget to leave me a comment down below which outfit was your favorite and yeah don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel as well. I would absolutely love to have you part of my YouTube journey. I'm so so grateful that you stumbled across this video. Again I really really hope that you liked it. Sending you all so so much love. Be safe on New Year's. I'm not going to say May 2022 be our best year yet because I don't want to jinx it. But fingers crossed, fingers crossed, <laughs> fingers crossed that 2022 will treat us super, super well. Sending you all so, so, so much love into the new year. May all your wishes come true and don't forget to be gentle with yourself. I know that there's so much pressure to like be super strict with our like, um, with our New Year's resolutions and let's make the last two weeks of 2021 super good. And if that's like what is making you feel good, do it. But also don't forget to take some rest. This is such a hard time of the year. It's so busy for so many different people, especially with, with what's going on. So give yourself some love. I'm sending you guys the biggest, warmest wishes. Sending so, so, so much love. May you have a beautiful, beautiful new year. I love new year, it's my favorite holiday. There's just something so special about, about a new year. We get to experience new things. Um, I don't know, I love New Year's so much. It's just, I'm, I'm from Moldova and New Year's is like the big one for us. I know Christmas is the big one for a lot of people in the Western world, but New Year's is the big one for us. That's where Santa Claus comes and all that good stuff. So I love New Year's so much. It's just, it's so special to me. So um yeah don't forget to let me know which outfit was your favorite i really hope you guys like this video and i will see you in the new year thank you guys so much peace and love